Hi viewers, welcome to Rasa Vinsuve. Today I am going to make uh, a chutney with banana stem. I have already posted one uh, chutney with uh, urad dal. Now this is a chutney which I am going to make with uh, peanut and uh, dahlia and few other ingredients. So let us see what are the ingredients. These are banana stems. I have cut and uh, kept it here. Now in this banana stem while uh, cutting you have to remove the thread like substance. See here. This you have to remove it. After cutting also see I have uh, using a fork I have uh, removed the thread see here in this you can see this you have to remove one and a quarter inch banana stem I have taken and uh, other ingredients two teaspoon of um, dahlia 2 teaspoon of uh, singdana that is peanut a small piece of uh, tamarind salt as required this is hing powder this is 1 teaspoon uh, fennel seeds for tempering you need mustard seeds and uh, curry leaves and 1 teaspoon uh, white sesame seeds uh, roasted and uh, quarter cup coconut a small piece of ginger spice according to your requirement you add I have taken a small piece of green chili which is very spicy according to your requirement you add the spice and uh, few coriander uh, leaves and I will also add one sprig of curry leaves in it now the kadai is hot the kadai is hot I will add coconut oil in this around 2 teaspoon of coconut oil now we will add the singdana in it roast it when it is half done add the dahlia in it the tamarind teas coconut and uh, green chili you can use also red chili if you want roast it for a minute garlic also you can add if you wish the king powder fennel seeds instead of fennel seeds you can add uh, jeera also now the curry leaves goes in and the uh, banana stem the banana stem should uh, get cooked in this 
you can remove the dahlia and the peanuts after roasting i just added everything together you have to saute this for a, about 7 uh, to 10 minutes if you chop it very finely it gets cooked fast if you chop it uh, bigger chunks then it takes time we'll add the salt also in this adding the coriander leaves in it with stem you can add it now i'm switching off the gas now allow this to cool and uh, grind while grinding you can add the sesame seeds also because it is roasted otherwise you have to roast the sesame seed and add to it now let it get cool then we'll grind this to a smooth paste now the chutney is ready this goes well with the uh, rice chapati puri bakri you can have this it's quite tasty if you use red chili the color will be changed i have used uh, green chili that's why the color is green now we'll uh, add little oil in the तड़का पैन द टेस्टी बनाना स्टेम चटनी इज ready here thank you so much for watching the video subscribe to my channel like share and comment eat healthy stay healthy see you soon with another interesting recipe till then bye bye If you are watching my channel for the first time do subscribe to my channel and I thank my viewers for supporting me and my channel